Hello viewers, good mornings, another beautiful day, yep, hope your five senses work, health and strength is good, or excellent, what, what's up, what's up, what's up, Steam Deck fans, you know, this tribe, nation, universe, world, legion, what's good, <laughs> mob, what's up, the squad, what's up, nerds, geeks, and freaks, and you investigators, alright, listen to this, Steam Deck frame rates just rocketed, thanks to this update from AMD, AMD FSR 3.1 being added to games is a huge play that could see the greatest new games run better on Valve's handheld for, for years to come. Mm. AMD's FSR 3.1 has been added to Spider-Man remasters and your other PlayStation titles, which is which is in itself seems like quite tame news, but the Steam Deck owners, it's incredibly exciting. Not only does the addition of this feature means games run better on higher uh, graphical settings, but it could see the Steam Deck remains relevant for a longer than we imagine. It says, as the best uh, handheld gaming PC, the Steam Deck is often used as the measuring stick for all other devices. The latest firmware update, SteamOS 3.6, bring in improved support for AMD FSR 3.1 which has big implications for the Steam Deck life cycle. AMD's FSR 3.1, which can offer both fidelity, super FX resolution, upscaling, and frame generation, can take a passable game on Valve's portable and consider considerably uh, boost performance. Then I reason, the reason I highlight Spider-Man Remastered earlier is because I've seen examples of players pushing this game into the very high graphical settings with FSR 3.1 enabled and still achieve smoothly uh, playable frames rate in the 60 to 70 FPS range with just occasional drops down to the, four, the 40s. Says here, uh, there is always the risk that enabling these two technologies will create input lags or visual uh, artifacts. However, my early testing on Ghost of Tsushima and Horizon Forbidden West suggests that the Performance boost is considerable, and the graphics downside are remarkably small. Uh, in fact, I would put it to Valve that it may even be worth re reassessing Horizon Forbidden West and the Steam Deck rating. It's currently marked as unsupported due to its demanding graphics, but if uh, Nixies were to create a Steam Deck graphical preset with AMD FSR 3.1 enabled, there's no reason why it shouldn't be marked as playable, at least. Then it says, uh, more importantly, AMD FSR 3.1 have a huge impact in games outside of the PlayStation titles to which uh, it was uh, recently added as Steam Deck hardware uh, uh, s starts to show its age and more powerful handheld uh, uh, flood the market. Uh, FSR 3.1 offers a genuine way to ensure the deck still performs in new releases and it may even take off take off the pressure when it comes to releasing the highly anticipated what Steam Deck 2 mm -hmm. <laughs> time will tell whether this can be the start of a secure future for the big AAA games on the Valve's handheld but even if some of the best Steam Deck game just run better. It's possibly change that every deck owner should be excited about. Hmm. Yeah, look, we're, we're all waiting for the Steam Deck too. You best believe it. We all are. <laughs> every Steam Deck owner is waiting on the Steam Deck too. You best believe it. We all are. <laughs> some some of us has, have, have already started like putting money into our Steam accounts. Yeah. Just in, t just in anticipation of it. Yeah, we've been waiting. <laughs> ever since <laughs> ever since the um the first Steam Deck came out, some people already started started um even before the OLED came out, people were already adding money to their Steam account. And, and then when they got the OLED, they still were adding money to their account. Because they were waiting for the Steam Deck too. Yeah, a whole bunch of people <laughs> is waiting, so yeah. Uh that Steam Deck 2 is gonna be something when when Valve when when news break of that when news break of it when when the news start to get uh, start to um, come out. But other than that, man, um, we couldn't find a game the Steam Deck couldn't run, man. Mm. Uh, FSR 3.1, uh, Spider 
Spider-Man Remastered, Spider-Man Miles Morales, um, um uh, what's it, uh, Horizon Forbidden West, oh yeah, I mean, um, games that are unsupported, uh, and I mean, they, they usually run well on the, uh, run well on the Steam Deck, so, yeah, and, um, you know, FSR is just like the icing on the cake, man, <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> so, uh, AMD, yeah, d d doing their thing, man, doing their thing. Uh, there's a video in this article. I will leave the link in the description box. So, and enjoy, enjoy it. But other than that, man, um, yeah, the Steam Deck, Steam Deck is no joke, man. <laughs> yeah, it's a bet. It's this hand, this handheld uh, pack uh, is, is, is 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 uh is doing its thing, man. You know, they said we couldn't find a game the Steam Deck couldn't run. Mm. Yeah, and um, it's been um. It's been lights out ever since, man. Ever since they opened that line of communication with the users, man. And when I got on Valve and I kept telling Valve, uh, they need to be in the news more. Video game news is like real estate. They got the message. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, uh, this, this handheld is it's doing its thing, man. So, keep pushing. FSR 3.1. Spider-Man Remastered. Mm. Wonder what Spider-Man 2 would, uh, would, uh, would it would, would look like um uh yeah wait a minute what's this gigantic open world racing game having a big free trial you can play as much as you want okay which which game is this let me see this caught my attention anyway but uh yeah the steam deck is just it's, it's worth it man whether you have the 64 gig model uh whether you have um 256 gig model LCD, the 512 gig uh, gig model LCD, or the 512 OLED or the one terabyte OLED, man, definitely worth it. Oh yeah, what game is this? Oh, the Crew Motor Fest free weekend is running from Thursday, July 4th to Monday, July 8th, and if you like it, you can buy it for a 16% off. It's currently uh, 27.99. Slash twenty three ninety nine from down from sixty nine ninety nine to slash out uh, fifty nine ninety nine until July eleventh. So okay, all right, it's the crew. All right, the crew motor fest. I'll leave the link in the description box, so I'll give you guys two videos out uh, to watch. Anyway, yeah, I got you guys covered, man. You know the Steam Deck way. What else we got? I seen something else here about the Steam Deck. Okay, we know one terabyte Steam Deck, OLED and HyperX gaming gear bundle. Meh. What are they talking about? Other than that, man, um, you guys are good, man. News, deals, games update. You guys are good. <laughs> yeah, I had video. I had videos done already. I had, I had videos done already. I was just like um, I was, I was deciding to uh, I was deciding to uh, figure out which video I was gonna put out. But I I had videos. I had videos done already. So yeah, from last night, you know. Even though people were letting off fireworks, I'm, I was making videos. <laughs> yeah. So, I got you guys covered, man. Don't worry about it. But anyway, enjoy your FSR 3.1, folks, with your games. And have fun, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the summer sale is over in six days. You still got some You still got some more games to get, you know. You still got some more games to get. <laughs> anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Nice talking to you people again. Chris, still Star Wars, Dark Knight, for Dark Side. Go. Peace.